All right, Dan, you asked for a video, so video it shall be. Um, I saw your Facebook posting. I, I actually have a, woo, there goes the dog. A little bit of free time right now. And you're welcome to all of it, Vita. Um, no, I have a little bit of free time right now. We just got done with a four-hour rehearsal. It was a full run-through, but it was choppy. Um, I know all my lines pretty well. I'm pretty happy with that. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so the, um, the play is going really well. I'll, I'll get some uh, video of this, um, of where we're going to be doing um, the play over in Fountain City because it's really a cool building. So, but I'm not going to tell you more about it. I'll have to show it to you. But um, let's see, the play opens a week from Wednesday. And, you know, so far I think we're, um, I think we're on schedule. We'll, um, you know, I, I don't think we'll have a problem with the play. Uh, there's still some choppy bits, but yeah, welcome to community theater. Um, you wanted to see video from the uh, variety show. Uh, unfortunately, no video is available as of yet. Um, the guy who did the video has still not actually given the video to Allison and uh, it's, it's rather too bad but you know there you have it Marshall can you put that over here underneath um, but uh, as soon as I get that video I'll, I will post it I can assure you because it's actually something I really want you to see but um, so let's see what else is happening I mean I guess I, I've just been spending so much time with Harvey um, which again is time in my opinion well spent I'm really I'm still really enjoying it um, and um, well let's see what else um, I don't know man I've uh, just not been much so much other than working um, I did go and do a um, the the bank call our commercial lender bank called and and um, Preston, go put it back, please. And asked if I would be a part of a three-person panel talking about how businesses are weathering these tough economic times and what we're doing to manage inventory and planning and plans for growth. I always think those questions are kind of funny for a business my size. But anyway, I was sitting with the um, the CFO from Watkins. You you probably know of Watkins. And I was sitting with the um, CFO of HBC, which is um, a broadband internet provider, um, really kind of a regional broadband internet provider based out of Winona here, um, both of which are so outside of, you know, our realm of uh, experience, but I know both the guys pretty well, and anyway, it was, it was enjoyable, and um, I, of course, introduced myself as the CFO of Mugby, and the CIO, the CEO, the COO, the CTF chief toilet fixer, um, and that I did everything else too. So, um, but uh, anyway, it was it was it was just a small group, and it was I don't know. What do you do? Um, I have been working uh, a great deal, as you can imagine, but it's not bad, uh, manageable. But really, I just you know, there's just not much going on other than Preston. Other than uh, you know, other than working that play, and, and I've been swimming, but not as much. Only twice a week. It's all I've been averaging. It's really been a bummer. But the uh, lakes are almost completely open now. Granted, I know the water is still cold, but I think by next weekend, um, all that ice will be gone, and I am going to go and try for a swim. So um, we'll see if anybody else will go. I don't think any of the other yeomen will do it, but um, I have already signed up for a two-mile point to the point. So you can search for that. Search for um, point, common spelling, to La Point, L-A-P-O-I-N-T-E, swim, and you'll and you'll see what I'm talking about. It's a two-mile swim off Madeline Island in um, Lake Superior, but it's not. The water is not quite as cold as it was um, up in um, uh, where it was, wherever it was, Lutzen last summer near Grand Marais, but. Um, there's a group, I think, of four of us so far that are going. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a really good time. Um, well, let's see. Um, there was something else I was gonna tell you about. 
through the bin. Um, hmm. Well, I've been writing lots of emails. I wrote a long one to Nikki where I referenced your dreadlocks. That was that was fun. I've uh, I actually was um, looking for a friend of mine. Um, well, I was looking for Kelly Zimmerman. And uh, I had, I couldn't find her on the internet. I, I knew that her last name, or I thought I knew what her last name was. And last I talked to her, I think she was living in Centralia. And um, I uh, went searching, um, searching for her, but couldn't find her anywhere. And I've been looking for a few years. And so finally I resorted to um, uh, emailing a friend of mine. Her name, well, I'm not going to tell you what her name is, but she works at Central Washington University, uh, a person I used to work for out there. Kelly and I both used to work for her. Kelly used to babysit for her. But um, I contacted this person and I said, you know, it would sure be nice if you could help me find Kelly. And Because I knew this person was a problem solver. It was great. So anyway, within an hour I had possible phone numbers that didn't work. Anyway, but by by the following day she had her, real, her new name uh, because her last name has changed, uh, an email address, a website, etc., etc. So I was able to drop her a line and just say howdy uh, more than anything else, but no meaningful chatter yet. Um, and, um, hmm, well, the golf courses are here open. I don't know if you saw my email. Maybe you didn't, but we actually have had really nice weather. As you can see, I'm sitting outside right now, and um, next week is supposed to be in the 70s the whole week. And this will actually be the first winter, I believe, in over a hundred years, that it has not snowed in March. Um, it's been a really temperate March, and a fairly dry one too at that. Uh, we've had some chilly temperatures, but no snow at all. Um, and like I said, the ice is usually not gone off the lake until the end of April, and um, it's almost all gone, well, more than half gone already. And, you know, I'm assuming next week's uh, 70s will just kill it altogether. Which makes the open water swimmer and me happy, of course. Um, and the golf courses are even open now, and they don't usually open till the last week of April, and they're already open a full month ahead of schedule. So um, everyone's happy, I guess. It's 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 nice. It's 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 nice. But um, um, let's see. Beth is going to be, um, I think, applying for a full-time job. Oops. Uh, at Winona State. She's interested in that. Her boss, of course, is very bummed because it's not likely in his department. But, uh, you know, times they change. So, well, let's see. Um, how about this? Harvey and I, we, we sit in the bars and we have a drink or two, play the jukebox. Soon, the faces of the other people turn towards mine and they're saying, we don't know your name, mister, but you're a lovely fellow. And Harvey and I warm ourselves in these golden moments. We've entered as strangers, and soon we have friends. They come over, and they sit with us, and they talk to us, and drink with us. And, and they tell us about all the big, terrible things they've done, and the big, wonderful things they will do. Their hopes, and their regrets, their loves, and their hates all all very large because nobody brings anything small into a bar well th then I introduce him to Harvey he's bigger and larger than anything and they they offer me and when they leave they leave impressed the same people seldom come back but that's envy my dear there's a little bit of envy is in the best of us too bad isn't it so I think that's all I got. I'm actually going to think I'm going to do a couple of videos. I've got something else to post, and I just don't know what it is yet, so I'm going to have to go think about it. Um, in the meantime, still dead.